Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another episode here on the Iron Man profile. Two days in a row. Who would have thought, right? Like I uploaded yesterday and now I'm uploading today. It's like, it's, uh, what's going on? I don't know. I'm pretty excited about it though. We have another Skyblog Iron Man episode for you guys today. I'm pretty excited about this one because we're going to be finally checking out the Kudra revamp. They revamped how this entire boss fight works finally because honestly, I can't believe that the last version even made it to the main server, but it has gotten a lot better. The rewards are better. You can finally get Crimson Essence by doing Kudra. Who would have thought that's how that works, right? But I'm super excited to jump into the, today's episode. We're going to be checking out tier one, two, three, and four, all the tiers that are out, trying out all the fights, seeing what we can get our hands on. If you guys are excited for that though, make sure to let me know by leaving a like. And if you do happen to be new here, don't forget to subscribe. It's completely free, helps out a ton. That way you don't miss any uploads in the future. And if you do find yourself checking out on the Hypixel store, don't forget to rock code Zach on checkout. That is my creator code. Helps immensely. Just Z-A-C-H on checkout. Doesn't cost you a single extra thing and helps a ton. But I'm so excited for today's episode. So uh, I'm going to stop rambling and let's just get right into this one. Before we get into the Kudra fights though, there's actually something I missed in my last upload. My upload yesterday, I missed something that they added. They added a bunch of new stuff to the bit shop. There's a few other things that they've updated that I also forgot to mention. We'll get into those in future episodes. I have full plans to touch everything. But basically, they added a couple new items to the bit shop, and there's one that's actually really, really good that we're going to be getting today. Uh, so one of the first things they had was Matriarch's Perfume. Consume to apply a pungent smell upon yourself, confusing the Matriarch in the Crimson Isle into releasing new pearls. This is actually really good. It was something that was time gave before getting pearls. So now those sweats who are just have tons of essence and want to max out a set, maybe this will be us one day. We can get some Matrix perfume, confuse them, get some more heavy pearls. So that's actually pretty dope. Uh, another thing they add was actually upgrades to sacks. So as you guys know, you can buy a rune sack and a dungeon sack. Now you can buy a pocket sack and a sack. Combine this item in an anvil with any sack to triple its capacity. Basically removing the need uh, for a lot of people to make multiple of the same sack. Like uh, I know, for example, Squid Kid has like four in mining, in large enchant mining sacks just so we can have like 80k storage. So this is actually really cool. We'll be using these in the future. Look forward to that. Um, the main thing though that is super, super important to me. They also add like the dyes are in here now. This wasn't in here last time I was here. Or there's a uh, new enchants, for example, Hedicomb and Champion. So that's really cool. We'll be touching on those in future episodes, especially when we get to dungeons again. Uh, the Portalizer, pretty cool stuff, but we're looking at the Abbey Phone Super Shop. Okay, purchase an Abbey Phone in the Crimson Isle to contact NPCs from afar. You can now buy cases. Okay, you can also upgrade how many contacts you have, but cases. Now, this is the really interesting thing because they aren't actually cases for your Abbey Phone, they're actually just on accessories talismans and um basically you can buy all these but keep in mind only one case will have an effect while in your accessory bag at a time and what's really cool is these ones here the blue abbey cases um these are actually really good because you can get combat wisdom mining wisdom forging wisdom farming wisdom and fishing wisdom basically to help with like all your skills and one of these will be active at a time so eventually i do want to get all five of them but for now we're going to go ahead and pick up the uh blue one the blue but red abby case they're, they're all they're all blue it says but basically this one will give us more combat xp basically and grants magical power per contacts in your abby phone really cool Seventeen thousand bits that is a lot we are going to go ahead and buy it though it's a brand new talisman so that's actually super nice we're going to go ahead and throw this in the accessory bag we love a new talisman when one comes out and uh, it wouldn't be me if I wasn't rocking that thing. Beautiful. There we go. Something I also got from when I haven't uploaded recently is I finally got my hands on the Jacobus Register. So that's really nice. And I, I expand my, my slots here by a few. So that, that's pretty nice as well. But brand new talisman. You'll love to see it. So we're going to be starting off by doing a tier one. They've changed this boss fight an actual ton. So it's going to be really interesting to see how it is. You no longer have to pay money when you get into... Kudra, which is actually pretty nice. You're gonna need a magma rod. I'm rocking a mage setup because apparently it's just mob spam, which is always fun. But we have a decently high level party, so hopefully these guys can uh guide me in the right direction. I, I guess you could say. I don't even know like which route to go with any of these, so we're gonna be checking that as well. There's still some cannons I see. Uh L is to oh my That looks so much better. That looks so much better. That
That is so sick. Okay, we need to fish these. Hook closer. It don't move. Okay, okay. Oh, my bad, bro. My bad. My bad. I did. I didn't mean to. I didn't realize it was that serious. You know. But yeah, there are gonna be a ton of mobs, which is either good or bad. And uh, I'm gonna be honest, pretty bad. So. Gonna have to deal with these. I don't think I'm like reforged for a mage setup. As you can see, I'm already out of like mana and everything. So that's gonna be fun. But that's why we're doing a tier one first. And then we're gonna figure all this out. So I believe you actually need to get supplies. And Kudra just looks so much better, by the way. Like the whole animation of them. So big fan of that. I think the admins actually killed it on that one. All the drops are being like put to the middle. We're at three of six. So we need to keep looking for these like supply crates that spawn everywhere. And then fish them up basically so don't move i'm not moving beautiful we picked it up and then you run it over here oh my goodness it makes you slow when you pick it up okay, i'm jumping and stuff and we bring the supply chest right here please there we go we got it so now we need to go ahead and actually like build the supply piles which is also going to be tedious because the mobs the mobs hurt i haven't even gotten this far on the fight before like this is like one of my first times properly trying it that's why we're doing a tier one though so supply pile sneak and punch Okay, I don't know if I'm helping, but I'm sneaking and I'm punching, and the mobs are coming for me. That is that is not chill. I did not sign up for that. Okay, we're building something. Oh, right. It builds like the giant crossbow. I think I saw a picture of this. So sneak and punch. I'm sneaking. I'm punching. Okay, we're building this. It's building up. Building a new thing. Should build like this giant crossbow thing, which will be honestly super cool. Okay, let's go over to this pile. This needs more work. And then maybe I'll maybe I'll start working on this pile here. Sneak and punch. Okay, we're sneaking. We're punching. You know, I, I don't know what else to do. I have a ton of tokens, but tier one, we won't really get a chance to uh, kind of do all that. Is our thing getting destroyed? Are they destroying it like while we're building it? That would be kind of annoying. Um, not sure exactly how all this works. Ugh, please stop. This is like almost fully built. There we go. Oh my goodness, he just keeps destroying it. We have to like build it fast enough. Do I need a pickaxe out? I'm, I'm not even sure if I'm helping. I'm hearing like punching noises, but no idea if i'm actually helping okay it looks like it's complete oh no we need fuel cells or something okay so apparently i think you buy fuel cells somewhere and then are we using someone said are we using cannon uh yeah we should be right it's not charged it needs to be charged what is that energized chunk explodes in 15 seconds we probably don't want that anywhere near here um okay there's kudra kudra's like chilling up close now the the way they have it looking is so much better by the way i don't exactly know how to use this cannon also, maybe we go the crowd control route. Get miniature. Oh, I got some miniature strikes. Miniature nukes. That sounds. That sounds good. No. Okay. Well, yeah. We'll, we'll fire some things at Kudra. I, I really have no idea how the new boss fight works. Figure out how to defeat defeat Kudra. That is what we're. That's what we're in charge of right now. Uh, shift to dismount. Right click to fire. Okay. Is not charged. Energized chunk releases a distorting blow to Kudra as it is destroyed. Plus 15 seconds until submerge. Okay. I don't know how to do that. Kudra is taking damage, however, though. So I think my teammates are finding ways to damage him maybe he's shooting a mount l is here helping too so that's chill i'll appreciate the help but i really don't know how to do like the finishing blow or how to how to like kill him like that i'm oh i shot like an energizing thing i don't know that seemed to have done some damage so that'd be that'd be nice you know he seems pretty mad oh yeah he's he's destroying stuff oh my goodness look at the arms the arms going everywhere kudra just looks way more like an actual boss now instead of like the derpy little thing he was before and kudra down okay my team somehow figured that out i need to ask them what i'm actually supposed to do there because i'm gonna be honest i'm not too sure 80 kudra essence which is way better open reward chest for a kudra key i'm actually gonna go ahead and do this there is an aurora helmet i don't really need that but What's in the free chest, actually? Two, yeah, okay, we're, we're opening this thing. 80 Crimson Essence is actually, like, so much in comparison to before, so. And we get teeth. Hey, we'll take it. Now we're moving on to a tier two, and my teammates actually just gave me, like, a really good rundown. Shout out to these guys, by the way. Vegan Trials, Poisonous Spider, and Mush Love, uh, because, honestly, you, you really do need someone with a hype, because otherwise you're actually just getting completely destroyed by the mobs i've tried it with some people who didn't have hypes and it was just a painful process so shout out to these guys but basically um and how you get like the cannon is you have to like fish up more fuel and then you can stun him by like getting eaten over here and then you go ahead and like beat up his like uvula which is like pretty gruesome when you when you say it like that but i mean hey listen the process is the process you know so we don't judge but uh okay there we go and now we're picking it up i'm not moving don't don't you worry i ain't going nowhere there we go got a supply drop beautiful let's run over here and place this thing down same thing you go ahead and get the supplies just like so uh we brought some supplies over which is look at us doing our job doing amazing and uh kudra um nice to see you buddy don't really want to see you that close but uh you know okay i think someone is someone already getting this no okay okay there we go 
and Kudra it has tossed me. Okay. But basically, I've also been informed that I should go the specialist route while we're doing this because it'll mean faster building, which is really good. Uh, so which one should I do? Building speed. Okay, this one for sure. Faster building speed because that did take a while in the first phase for me. I didn't really feel like I was doing too much in the building aspect. So that's actually really good to know. But there's still a ton I need to learn properly about this about this fight and how that works. So uh, that'll be good to know. But basically, I think we're about to start the building process once everything gets brought in over here. There we go. Now we sneak and punch. Okay, I can actually see percentage. Okay, their percentage is going up a lot faster than mine though. Let's go ahead and try and get this even higher and then when you sneak and punch uh luckily we have people with hypes doing like a bunch of damage okay i'm act i can actually see it being built i can oh, okay i'm also taking a lot of damage though i'm on the weaker side i don't know if me rocking a mage setup is the move i don't necessarily have a tank setup though so that would be nice to probably get in the future especially if i want to do higher tiers and not be as much of a full liability okay also kudra if you keep breaking my hard progress here that i'm doing i'm gonna be pretty mad i'm gonna be completely honest with you we're, yeah we're sneaking we're punching we're being we're being bashed around by these knockers which is is never fun really and kudra's about to destroy some even more stuff you can see his arm it's lining up once you get one to complete i think he can even undo that yeah he did okay so let's try and repair this area there we go we're actually repairing it faster now though beautiful this pile is nowhere close to being done though. Let's keep building. Kudra's about to destroy some more stuff. So we need to get this thing built ASAP because uh, yeah, that, then I think once it's fully built, then it'll stay built, which is good. But uh, yeah, Kudra just keeps undoing our progress here. Luckily, L is over here helping out. L, we appreciate the support. There we go. So the barrage is built, uh, or the ballista, sorry. The ballista is complete now. I don't think you can break it anymore. Now I think you can fish up Yule. Kudra Slayer. Okay, this sounds this sounds good, right? Maybe we should maybe we should get some of that. But basically, how we killed it in the first one is we were shooting the orbs back at it. That's actually how we were killing them. And so that was that was good to know. Energized chunk. We're gonna launch this thing in his direction. I think he's somewhere over here, right? There we go. He is. Okay. And so basically, you can stand here at the crescent spot and uh, get eaten up. We aren't gonna try that. We have someone else who is in charge of doing that. So I will happily let them get consumed by the monster, and I, I will kind of just chill. But here we have uh, some fuel that we need to try and like hook closer. So let's try and pull this thing closer and then click to pick up. Okay, there we go. We're picking it up. We're getting a fuel cell and then we have to bring it over to kind of fuel it up. So we got our fuel cell. This is how you get the fuel for the ballista, which is pretty cool. I like this aspect. And uh, let's go over here and oh, Okay, recover the fuel cell and charge the bliss. Okay, cool. It actually charged it. So now, once he's stunned, then I think we try and like shoot him. I think the ballista is like just charged up or something. Or oh, there we go. It just shot. Okay, that's that's pretty sick. So that does some damage. Now basically, I think it's uncharged again. It is. That is correct. So we need more fuel. We need to find some more fuel cells, or it's charging up right now. Energy charge is only twenty percent. That is just not gonna cut it, in my opinion. So yeah, let's head over down here, bring this closer, and then click to pick it up. Okay, there we go. Oh, or not. Uh, thank you, Kudra, for humbling me every time I seem to get close to you. There we go. We're picking it up, please. We got it. We got it. Beautiful. Now we run this little fuel cell over, doing the best we can, run it across an absolute battle fuel, uh, battlefield. There we go. 80%. Okay, so we need one more fuel cell, uh, and then he should be he should be chill. So there we go. We got another one right here. Let's try and pick this up. Okay, he picked it up. He picked that up really fast. Okay. Oh, pearls. That's why they were telling me to bring pearls. So you could charge it up faster. There we go. He's getting ready to shoot. And the ballista is about to launch. There we go. The shot. Beautiful. That might actually kill him. I think it did, if I'm not mistaken. I could be very wrong here, but I do believe that was the finishing blow. No? I guess we'll see. We're still surviving to the mobs. Maybe we have to go and get more. It did kill him. There we go. Kudra down. Beautiful. We finished it. That was a hot tier. And uh, in return, we got Fervor chest plate, attribute shard, 200 crimson essence. I will happily use a hotkey for that. That is actually so much essence. I'm happy that you can finally get essence from doing Kudra, which is how this should have been in the first place. It shouldn't be fishing is the way to get essence. So 200 crimson essence. Thank you very much. I think we're going to move on to a tier three, but uh, yeah, that's how the tier two fight kind of goes. And uh, let's see if we can survive a tier three. So I just asked him to give me party or quick because I wanted to see the Q menu for anyone who was wondering. So Kudra is a lava kraken. Uh, this has a lot. Uh, it's a cooler screen now, I think, in my opinion. But as you can see, uh, there's the tier the basic tier which we did we did we just did a hot tier next we're doing burning which i do have a key for i don't have a key for fiery which we're also going to attempt to do 
Uh, you also need um, 7,000 reputation to do this. And then you need 12,000 reputation to do infernal tier, which I don't believe is out at the moment. I don't think this tier is out. So overgrown lava crack and the more sulfur it consumes, the stronger it becomes. It's the same for all these. But party size of two to four different tiers, you need to beat the previous one to do the next. And uh, yeah, we're going to go ahead and try and take on a burning tier now. So wish us luck. And uh, let's see how this goes. We are now on to a tier three. I don't see a world where this goes well for me. I just... I just don't. I, I really wish I could. But uh, L is about to fish this man up here. Kudra, please be nice to me. Uh, we're going to try a tier 3. And uh, I don't know if a tier 4 will be possible. I do have the rep, but it is so hard to find people. Like, we got Shadow Swayze in on this one. If you guys don't know him, he streams Skyblock Iron Man as well on his Twitch. You guys should go check him out. Shadow Swayze on Twitch. Go show him some love. Let him know that I sent you. But uh, yeah, we are going to do our absolute best here. So... We hook this closer. We got this thing. Oh, j boy, please. Nah, bud. Holy. Okay, let me just, please. Let me just put down my supplies. Thank you very much. Okay, already off to a scary, scary start. But, you know, it's 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 chill. It's something light for us. You know, this is um, this is our first tier three, which means it should be easy, right? And that's that's how the game is, right? It's, it's easy when it's like your first time doing something. That's, that's how Skyblock works. Okay, we should be able to get this last one. There we go. Beautiful. Run me over. Nice and slow. All the mobs just disintegrated, which you just love to see. Drop the supplies, please. Supplies, go. Thank you very much. I, I didn't want the responsibility of having you on me anymore. Okay, lava. This instance is like lagging, I'm going to be honest. But uh, it should be chill. We're going to go with the specialist route. Yes, I am sure. Let me buy up the building faster. And... Uh, we should be able to start building here pretty soon, which is going to be nice. Pretty chill. I am enjoying the boss fight more as I learn how to actually be useful. I think that'll be more enjoyable as well. Uh, let's let's move over to another pile before we get absolutely crushed. But uh, the mobs are starting to get quite a bit stronger, which is a little scary. I'm not I'm not entirely scared, but you know I'm I'm like I'm scared a little, you know. So that that's that's chill. We're sneaking and punching, and I'm not seeing any progress on this going up. Okay, you guys will not believe it. I don't know how much of this fight I have recorded because I ran out of disk space. This is the Kudra consumption zone. So someone's going in there to get stunned. Uh, we've gotten the fuel. He's stunning in 3, 2, 1. He is stunned. As you can see, he's spinning. The ballista's being loaded up. And shot Shadow Swayze. What a brave soul. Beautiful. What a hit. And that melted about half his health. So we, I think we have to do that one more time. So let's get over here and try and... Try and get some fuel over here uh, as fast as we can because, uh, you know, this is this is serious stuff going on here. I have no idea how much of this boss fight I've recorded. Hopefully a decent amount. If I haven't, I'm sorry. We've got our supplies. We built the ballista. We're fueling it up. Same as the other floors except for everything just hurts a little more. And uh, that's basically what's going on. So, yeah, we need to look for fuel. What percentage are we at? 60% charged. That is beautiful. Okay, here's a fuel cell. Let's pick this one up. Uh Kudra, Kudra decided otherwise. Honestly, I don't blame him. I really don't. So let's try and let's try and pick this up again. I'm 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 being knocked around. Don't move. Uh, it's it's harder than it sounds. Gonna be completely honest. It is much harder than it sounds. This mob is uh, giving me a very very hard time. If you'd be so kind as to not, but um, you know that's chill. Okay. And okay, the ballista's charged up again. We're getting some shots off. And there we go. The ballista is gone. Kudra's health is no more. I think we actually did the tour, the, the tier. I'm going to be honest. I'm getting fully carried in these. I, I truly just want to see them. I don't have like any, I have like one key and uh, that's all I have to my name. So I can't even run these. I won't be, I won't be spamming them and getting ahead by any means, but I just wanted to see it. So there we go. A tier complete. What did we get? Hollow legs. Okay. That's the new set, right? That is part of the new set and 400 essence as well as trophy hunter two your teeth we're gonna go ahead and get that let's open up the chest beautiful the amount of essence this is giving is truly amazing uh, i can't wait to put this on like my crimson or i think aurora is now like the move because you really do need a mage setup but uh someone got a molten cloak that sounds pretty that sounds pretty hype but yeah that's a tier three sorry if i didn't record most of it but it's it's very similar throughout the phases time for a tier four run this is as high as kudra goes up to so far it doesn't get more difficult than this so this should be interesting. I don't even have a key, which kind of feels like a bit of a waste, but I did want to showcase like the difficulty of tier four in this video. Kind of wanted to go through all of them. Uh, definitely in future videos, we'll be grinding like a certain tier and I won't be showing you guys the full fights, obviously, because 
I mean, we'll just be we'll just be doing a bunch of them. I'll be grinding for a bunch of keys in the future video as well. So look forward to that. And then we can kind of start working on like an Aurora or like a really good Crimson set and work on kind of getting that towards like Infernal and. So a lot of work ahead, do not get me wrong, but I, I'm honestly really excited for it. And uh, this Kudra is already giving me a hard time, bro. Please just let me, let me get this. Okay, no, okay. You are, you are being pesty, my friend. You are being pesty at best. And uh, that's me, that's me being nice. I'm gonna be complete. Okay, you're, he's just not being nice to me. He is just not being nice. I mean, someone's gotta take the hits while everyone else gets stuff, right? But he does also have like a billion tentacles. So it, it's kind of hard, but uh, Hey, we're, we're going for this thing again. Please just, please just give it to me, you know? Please, I'm, I'm actually begging. Um, is this close enough? Surely, right? Okay. He... <sighs> this guy, this guy. Oh my goodness. He is, he is not being too nice to me. I'm going to be completely honest, but maybe I'll let someone else grab that one. So all the supply drops have been gathered, and uh, now we're going to start the building process here in a second. Let me actually go ahead and upgrade this even more. I want, I want to be building fast, you know, but I am taking a considerable amount more damage. In fact, that was actually the closest I've been to dying right there. So we do need to be a little bit careful in that regard. Everything does hurt a lot more on this floor. So hopefully someone can just run through with their hype and uh, maybe save me, but... Yeah, everything does hurt a lot more. Um, oh, yeah, okay. Kudra's arm just like landed on me there. That was that was not cozy. That was not cozy. That was not comfortable. See, I'm not making any progress on building this thing, which makes me a little bit confused. Like, I have this upgraded to max, 100% more building speed. Okay, there we go. We're getting some building progress, but it just feels like everyone else is building so much faster than I am. Let me know in the comments down below why that might be. Am I, like, not doing enough damage or... What is this? What is that? That looks cool. I don't know what that is, but I, I I feel myself helping the build, but it just feels like everyone builds so much faster than I do. So maybe I'm completely wrong, but I what are you? What are you? Okay, he, he grew into something. That little blob I was staring at on the floor is now a real person. They became their own thing. And uh, now he's gone though, luckily. So that's good. But now we go, need to go basically run around, get the fuel again. Look at this closer. I don't think I can get any closer than that. Kudra, please don't. Just, just don't. I'm just not in the mood today. My friend, I am just not in the mood for your shenanigans. Like this, these are shenanigans right here. I'm not in the mood for them. Please. Okay, you are bothering me. I'm going over here and trying to get another fuel cell. Clearly over there, he is mad. I don't know who made him mad. It wasn't me. There's no way. Please don't be mad. Let me, let me, let me get the fuel, please. I'm, I'm actually begging. I feel like it's going slow. Okay, 100%. Beautiful. Let's run over here. I don't know who's ballisting. Wait, is there only me and one person left alive? There's no way, right? Surely that's a bug. No, I swear I've seen more than two people running around. Okay. But, yeah, we need to run around, get the fuel, charge up the ballista, and then maybe we can actually take him on. Okay, well, things... That fuel piece is just not obtainable from Kudra. He's just... He just ain't rocking with that. Which, uh, you know, to each their own. To each their own. Um... But now I need to find another one. I got another piece of fuel. Running it over. Please get in the fuel cell. What are we at? 80%? Oh my goodness. Is, is it going to come down to this one stupid little fuel cell? I got mobs on me. Uh, this guy said waiting for 100%. I don't blame you. We're, we're working on it. We are work. Okay. Well, I was working on it. And then Kudra changed his plans on me. Man, he is just being a pain in my bum at the moment. Let me just... Okay, someone someone else got the fuel. Beautiful. So now someone is going to basically get swallowed up by Kudra. He's stunned now. And now the ballista is being charged and is about to be fired. There we go. The ballista is being charged back. And boom. There we go. Critical hit, obviously. Um, actually, that did less damage than last time. Do we have to shoot it four times? Is that how this works now? Uh, I'm not entirely sure. What's crazy is that there's going to be another tier even harder than this. Because, I don't know if you see this, look, like, what in the, like, paint.net is going on on my screen right now with all these things being spawned in. We need to kill this thing here. So I'm going to try and help with that just a little. Beautiful, that is gone. We need to get some more fuel, which is also a uh, area of concern at the moment. Let me try and hook this closer. Can I get this, please? Beautiful. Okay, that's going pretty quick. I also have a ton of tokens. I should try and upgrade something. But uh, there we go. We got another piece of fuel. Let's run this over. 
try and get past it's at 60 percent fueled right now i should put it at 80 beautiful we need one more i'm sure someone's uh someone's working on that maybe we're gonna this kudra slayer that seems important steady hands oh speed up when collecting why have i not been upgrading this the whole time there's still tons i need to learn with the shop and it is a little bit hard to learn while you're like in the process of it but i think you can actually look at these things before you go ahead and uh, get into it okay it's charged beautiful can we just launch and fire okay i think we fired that that felt like a good hit that felt like a good hit we need to do it two more times so it's basically twice as long in uh this in tier four than the times before so let's try and get the fuel Beautiful. We did some damage to Kudra, though. You guys can't say we didn't, you know? Okay, wow, that collected so much faster. That was really, really good. Don't let the magma followers merge. I don't know how to stop that. Like, these things? I'm, like, being sucked in by them. That is new. Also, there's an iron golem running around, so that's chill. Do I have to kill, like, a golem boss? I feel like I'm in the end. No? Uh, this thing is being melted. Beautiful. Dead. My health... However, also on the melting side, what percent are we at in fuel? 100%. Okay, we are ready for another shot. We are ready for another shot. Okay. Someone's got to stun him. Someone has got to get in there and stun this man. I'm on the ballista. I died. Okay, apparently it doesn't show your health when you're on the ballista. Okay, we're back in. I forgot that your health doesn't show when you're on the cannon, which honestly I feel like should be fixed. But everyone's saying finish with orbs now. So these orbs that spawn, we shoot them at Kudra, and uh, that's basically how we're going to finish the fight because there are orbs that do a little bit of damage. But if you want to do a lot of damage, you need to use the ballista and charge it up. But uh, I think he's low enough health where we can kind of just try and get some of these orbs and finish them off like that. There we go. I shot an orb at him. We're doing some damage. Someone's also working on getting fuel at the moment. That orb is not going the right direction. Let me get that going the right... Did he just block it? I'm trying to trying to send this towards him. No? No, we ain't, we ain't rocking with that. Kudra is getting very low on health, though. There goes another orb. Make sure that one lands on him. Beautiful. Uh, his health is getting significantly low right now, so... If we can finish him off soon, that would be very ideal. This this floor takes a lot longer than the other ones I've seen so far. There we go. I think he only has a sliver of health. I see like a little sliver on my boss bar. Or he might actually be gone. He might actually be dead. No, I think he has a little bit more. Okay, so let's try and get a couple more of these orbs going. I don't know where that one just went, but he should be gone. Is he gone now? He might be dead. He's blowing up. He's sinking. I think we beat him. I think we'd be a tier four Kudra. There he goes, disappearing. One last flail before admitting defeat, huh? There we go. Good job, everyone. A hard fought battle. What a beautiful conclusion. Tier four. No, I don't have a key. A molten cloak. Is that good? I feel like that's good. No, maybe it's not as good as I think it is. I think you can get it on other floors. Yeah, okay, you can get it on lower floors, but still it would have been really nice to get it. And also 800 Crimson Essence. I don't have a key which is kind of a throw and why I don't really want to do any more until I do get some keys. So we're rocking with our four free Crimson Essence for our, our, our fight here. But I mean, four, you know, we'll take the four, I guess, but that 800, that looks pretty good too. Man, what a fight though, that one took a while. So there you have it. All the brand new Kudra tiers. Honestly, I'm a massive fan of this revamp. And as I was going through each run, I was actually learning a ton about how it worked. I wanted to try to go into it without looking anything up or watching any footage on it. Honestly, maybe I should have because there's a lot of things I wish I knew in earlier runs, like some of the first tiers that we did. But honestly, now that I've done all four, I do feel pretty confident in myself that I know what I'm doing and I know what's going on every phase. Obviously, I need to work on getting a better setup so I can actually contribute more and we're going to need to grind a ton of Kudra keys so if you guys are excited for that we should be streaming some of that in the next couple of days that should be pretty dope but that's gonna be it for me in today's episode hopefully you guys did enjoy it. if you did make sure to let me know by leaving a like don't forget to subscribe if you guys are new around here join the discord and check out all my other socials in the description down below thank you so much for all the support on yesterday's videos and today i'm sure so thank you so much and without further ado i can't wait to see you guys in the next one take care and peace out